Let's go back 8-10 years. Electric cars were a luxury item for most people. A time when 1 kilowatt hour would cost anywhere between 800 to 1000 US dollars. Most countries had no user-friendly charging infrastructure. Fast forward to 2021 and it's a completely different story. You can now buy 1 kilowatt hour for a little over 100 US dollars. Modern first world cities have and continue to invest in better charging infrastructures. The writing is on the wall. Electric cars are the future. In this video, you'll get an order list showing you which countries have the highest demand. Based on our research, we found 10 countries that are taking serious strides over EVs. This list is based on the population, market share of the country, and the EVs registered in that country. So let's start countdown. Number 10. Switzerland Switzerland is neutral, beautiful, has high standards of living, and is somewhat serious with electric cars. While it can't stack up to countries like Iceland, Norway, or Sweden, year after year growth has been going up. As of April 2016, there have been over 12,000 electric vehicles registered. Market share figures are at 2.55% even though the Swiss government does not offer any financial incentives. In some divisions, you may qualify for annual tax relief. Number 9. Austria Austria is much like Switzerland, beautiful in every way. Surrounded by majestic mountains, it's blessed with a rich history. If you get a chance to visit, do it. When it comes to EV adoption, plug-in vehicle sales went up by 22% in 2018. In the first half of 2019, 4,913 new EVs were sold, representing 2.8% of the overall sales. Being Germany's neighbor, the best-selling electric vehicle is the Volkswagen e-Golf. Number 8. China China homes almost 1.5 billion people, the most in the world by country. If you ever watch the news, you see them slam China for having polluted air in cities like Beijing. The CCP has been pressing hard to change their country's image to be a sustainable nation. According to figures, they are doing exactly that. China managed to reach a market share of 4.20%. It wouldn't surprise us to see China take over many countries in the next decade. Number 7. Finland It looks like Finland has high hopes for an electrified future by 2030. The Finnish government has set an aim to have 250,000 plug-in cars and 50,000 biogas cars. In October of 2016, there was a recorded 2,250 EVs registered. Sales also reached 854 electric vehicles in the first three quarters of 2016. You may be thinking that are not that many sales based on the size of the country, but actually, it's quite good. Especially when you consider that they have the same market share of 4.20% as China. Number 6. Andorra As of 2017, Andorra's market share has reached 5.6%. For such a small country, that means they are buying electric cars like there's no tomorrow. The country also offers many incentives for current and future EV owners including financial aid in purchasing an electric vehicles, authorizing to travel in bus lanes, free passage through the Tunnel D and Velera, discounted charging. Number 5. Portugal Portugal had early ambitions to get the whole country electrified. In 2009, Portugal worked with Renault and Nissan to create a nationwide charging network. One year later, they started offering financial incentives for the first 5,000 electric vehicles purchased. In 2014, the estimated number of vehicles sold was a measly 283. As of December 2019, there were 29,700 plug-in passengers' cars in use in Portugal. Of these, 15,980 were fully electric cars and 13,720 were plug-in hybrids. The market share rose from 0.8% in 2016 to 3.7% in 2018 and achieved 5.7% in 2019. Number 4. Netherlands the Netherlands is a small country consisting of flat plains and windmills. Okay, I am oversimplifying this place, but it's a nice place to visit if you ever have a chance. When it comes to electric vehicle ownership, they have recommitted themselves. 
the plug-in market share declined from 9.9% .9 in 2015 to 6.7% in 2016 and fell to 2.6% in 2017. After several adjustments in the financial incentives and tax code to favor the purchase of all electric vehicles, the market share rose to 14.9% in 2019 and 24.6% in 2020. As of 31 December 2020, there were 297,380 highway legal light duty plug-in electric vehicles registered in the Netherlands, consisting of 182,481 fully electric cars, 108,652 plug-in hybrids, and 6,247 all-electric light utility vans. Number 3. Sweden being right next door to the number one most EV-friendly country in the world has its perks. Sweden made to number three on this list as the country with a market share of 32.2%. As of December 2020, a total of 217,704 light-duty plug-in electric vehicles have been registered since 2011. That number consisted of 148,889 plug-in hybrids, 62,870 all-electric cars, and 5,945 all-electric utility vans. Passenger plug-ins increased their market share from 3.5% in 2016 to 5.2% in 2017, rose to 11.3% in 2019, and achieved a record take rate of 32.2% in 2020. Number 2. Iceland who would have thought Iceland would be number 2 on this list? This island country has a very impressive 19 person market share. For a country with less than 400,000 people, they seem to be very friendly towards electric and plug-in hybrids. Per capita in 2017, the country had 2,990 plug-in vehicles registered, up 157% from the previous year. As of March 2020, passenger plug-in market share of total new car sales for the year 2020 has reached 55%. If you're wondering how the country can have such a high jump in plug-in vehicle registrations, it's because of the government. Tax incentives and huge savings are what's leading people towards the EV route. Number 1. Norway Norway is leading the pack when it comes to the market share. The government wants to transition to 100% EVs by 2025. No matter where you look, Norway is painted as a heaven for EV ownership, for good reason. Norway gets the biggest priority for different types of electric vehicles. The plug-in electric passenger car segment captured a market share of 29.1% in 2016, 39.2% .2 in 2017, 49.1% in 2018, rose to 55.9% in 2019, and achieved 74.7% in 2020. Meaning that 3 out of every 4 new passenger cars sold in Norway in 2020 was a plug-in electric. As the government heavily taxes fossil fuels, more people will be switching to EVs. The 2025 projection seems quite achievable at this pace. We've reached the end of this video. By now you know some information you didn't know before. Was there a country that you didn't expect would be on this list? For us, we never thought Iceland would be number 2. We also thought Japan would be somewhere closer towards the number 1 spot. But after doing the research, this is the information we came across. If you enjoyed watching this and you'd like to see more, like it, then subscribe to our channel, and last but not the least, share this with your friends.